Hey guys, it's Maddie. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today, as you guys saw from the title video, I'll be attempting to make my own, very own Starbucks drink. I don't feel no pressure. Starbucks drink. Okay, so other morning I woke up and I was like, I want something to drink. I want something summer, summer vibes, you know. And the first thing that I thought of was Starbucks, obviously. Everybody gets Starbucks during the summer, during the winter, all year round. And I was like, why not me get one? You know, why not me get one? So I was gonna get one, but then I was like, why not make one? You know, attempt to make one homemade. So that exact day. I, you know, lashed out to the store, bought a bunch of stuff to make this, went through the ingredients on the Starbucks app, and here we are. So, today I'm going to be attempting to make a strawberry acai lemonade Starbucks refresher. Mouthful. But, we did get all the ingredients, I'm about to show you guys the little haul of all of it. Um, but before we do get into the video, make sure y'all smash the like button, subscribe, turn the post notification bell, so you're notified every time I post a new video. Love y'all so much, thank you guys for all the love and support. Yeah, so another thing is we're in my kitchen for today's video. Um, yeah, this is the first time in the kitchen. So, ooh, yeah. So, for today's video, we got all the ingredients, so now I wanna show you guys them. Okay, so the first thing that I got was this Simply Lemonade, it's like raspberry lemonade. And I thought, I like to me, raspberry and strawberry taste the same, so I just got that. Then I got this tea because it said to get um like lemon tea so i got this pure leaf lemon tea next i got some regular lemonade then i got these two things that we're going to like mix the stuff in but obviously yeah um then i got some honey i'm gonna put a little bit of honey i got obviously the main ingredient strawberries and then we have this big pitcher that we're gonna put all of it in at the end then we have this bowl and then we have a plate so the first thing that we're going to get to doing, we're going to get to do a lot of stuff, but first we have to get the ice, because obviously we need ice, but we're going to get that in a minute before we start, um, you know, doing all this. But first thing is we're going to get settled in our space, so we're going to put everything to the side. Ew. And I got some sugar, I forgot to say that, um, but yeah. So we're moving everything everywhere, um, but yeah. So. I don't think we're going to make it in the pitcher. I don't think that's how it works. So we're going to grab this. And what we're going to add in here is um, probably the strawberry lemonade. So first we're going to add in the strawberry lemonade, however Starbucks does it. Um, they didn't really say what order and how they do it. You basically like, when you order from Starbucks, you can choose and make your own custom order. So it was like different things you could pick out of, like different selections, so I just picked the things that I'd like. Um, and obviously you can add tons of other things, which I will add the link in the description so you guys can check out like the recipe and stuff from Starbucks. So yeah, but that's what we got. So I'm gonna sit that over there and we're going to fill this up to like halfway. So that's what we're gonna do right now. I think that's pretty good. That's good. Okay, so the next thing that we're gonna do is we're going to probably get a little bit of this lemonade. Ugh. This stuff is a little bit heavy, surprisingly. I'm gonna get a little bit of this lemonade. Oh. Why am I trying to pour it and I didn't even open it? That was such a bogus move. So I added a little bit of lemonade in there, like that. Now we're gonna open this tea. I didn't get a big one because obviously I don't need a big one. So, cause we're just gonna add a little bit. Hopefully this tastes good. Um, I never tried the Starbucks one, but I'm gonna, hopefully this tastes like it. I don't know. But the next thing that we have to get is the ice, I guess. Well, the next thing that we're actually gonna do is we're going to close this. We're gonna like mix it all up, I guess. So we're gonna shake this. 
So Starbucks has their own machine that they mix the stuff in, but my machine is, you know, my strongness as my hand shakes. That's my machine that I mix mine in. And you see how that looks perfect. That looks exactly like the drink on mine. So that looks perfect. <laughs> Sorry, I had to open that. Okay, so the next thing that we're gonna do is we're going to close that back up. I don't know why I opened that. We're gonna set that to the side, but we're gonna keep it in the refrigerator so that it's stay cold. Fit. So the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to basically chop up some strawberries. Well, we're gonna do that at the end, but we have to basically mix and mash some strawberries. So we're gonna mash strawberries to make the strawberry puree to put in it. So I'm very excited to taste that. So we got our strawberries and we're gonna go wash it off really quick and then we're gonna come back. Um, yeah, we're gonna come back when it's time to mash okay, our Okay guys, so all of our strawberries are washed off. So now we're going to take off the little leaves and put them in the trash because we can't eat the leaves, obviously. And I didn't, like when I first thought of this, I didn't know how to mash the strawberries. But then I was looking in our drawers in the kitchen and I found this thing that normally goes onto a mixer, but it's this right here. And I think I'm just gonna hit them and mash them with that. But I also have a spoon just in case that doesn't work out. Um, so yeah. And yeah, so I went to the store yesterday and um, the lady said that these are the freshest strawberries because she was just restocking the strawberries and the fruit um, like area. So yeah. So now we have all of our strawberries, um, have their leaves off, and now we're going to start mashing them. So I don't know how to like, oh my God, that actually worked. This one's like completely mashed. Not completely, but they're getting there. Guys, I didn't think this would actually work. Okay. I'm an official Starbucks barista. Hashtag chef, hashtag barista. And editing, can you like edit a little hat in that clip? Thanks. Okay, so obviously it's smelling like strawberries a lot, but once we're done mashing this all up, we're gonna add a little bit of sugar, honey, and then the tea. And that's gonna be our puree. If I'm putting this in a picture, I'm not going to be the only people eating this. Obviously, my parents are going to try this, my brother, um, you know, whoever wants to try it, come over. <laughs> and you guys can try this too. And I'll like put all the steps, all the steps will be on the screen as I go, and it will also be in the description. So if y'all want to try this recipe out for yourself, go ahead. It's honestly fire. But. Yesterday when I was going to the store, I made a little TikTok vlog of me getting all the ingredients and stuff. That was pretty fun. So I'll, I'll pop that up on the screen so y'all can see that. That was very fun to do. Um, but yeah. But guys, this is basically almost all mashed up. It's like very mushy. If y'all want to see it, this is what it looks like so far. Very mushy. Um, yeah, we're gonna mush it a little bit more and we'll be back once Okay, got it. Sugar. So, I think that the puree is pretty good and a go for the sugar and the tea. Um, there is tiny, tiny little bits of strawberries, but there will be chopped strawberries also in the drink, so that's totally fine. So this is what it looks like. It's very runny, so you already know that's what a puree is. So we're gonna chop it a few more times. Perfect. Like, the bits are so tiny that it's like really hard to fully chop them with the big little chopping thing, <laughs> the whisk. So yeah, so now we want to open up our sugar and I got the sugar open. Got the big, how big is this actually? Four pounds. So now we're going to get our spoon and we're going to, I like to mix the sugar before I actually take it out, but we're going to this little bit of sugar, run it across here. Okay. 
As soon as I got the ingredients, I just wanted to start making it, but obviously I couldn't because I wasn't ready all the way. So um, <laughs> I'm very happy to be doing this right now. And especially like when if you guys want more like cooking style videos like this. Cause these are honestly the funnest videos ever. Okay. I'm gonna mix them even more. And then we're gonna add one more, not even a full tablespoon, just like a little pinch. That much, y'all, like that much. And we're gonna sprinkle it in like that. And we're good. So now we're gonna mix okay. that. That's perfect. So now we're gonna get the milk. Um. Yeah, I just decided that I'm adding milk, like just a second. The milk doesn't expire, so that's a good thing. Um, I'm gonna open up the milk and how much milk are we gonna take? I don't even know. I'm gonna get a like full like cap full of milk. Like, that much milk and we're gonna put it in there. We're gonna take like three of those. That was very small. As I said, I don't really like milk that much. I personally don't like cereal, so yeah. <laughs> full cereal with milk. I like to eat my cereal dry. Anyways. Besides my picky eating, we have the milk inside of there. I don't know if y'all want to see that, but now we're going to mix that together. It's making like a really light um, red color. That's what we want. So we're gonna mix that up, keep stirring. Okay, I wanna try a little bit of the puree. Just a little bit. So we're gonna grab a little spoon, like this tiny little spoon, and we're gonna try a little bit of it. I'm actually excited to taste this. Okay, a little bit. That's really good. Like, I really thought that I was gonna be able to taste it, like taste the um, milk, but you're not able to taste it at all. So that's good. So now we're gonna put this back in the refrigerator. Put it in the refrigerator, so now we've got this big drink. And we're gonna close up the sugar, close everything that we just used before we start anything else. And we'll stir this up again. Perfect. So now, the next thing that we're gonna do is we're going to cut up some strawberries. And I'm very excited to put in up some strawberries. Um, yeah. So we're going to take the strawberries out and cut them up and I'll see you guys once we're there. Okay guys, so now it's time to cut up the strawberries. And we like cut one strawberry in the fourth, so that's how it works. Perfect, so now we're gonna do that to the rest of them. I'm very excited to try this. Like I've been saying this in the entire video, how excited I am to try this. Literally, I'm ecstatic, guys. I know Starbucks uses like frozen strawberries, but you know, we're gonna use fresh strawberries because we're the organic Starbucks. No, we're the Maddie Bucks. Wait, no, never mind. That doesn't really sound good. <laughs> um but yeah, I hope you all are having an amazing day. I'm gonna take a little shot here. Mm, that's good. This is a big strawberry. Yeah. I literally love strawberries. They're not a fruit that I normally like eat, eat, but like, they're good. They're good when I eat them. They're nice, fresh, sweet. So, this is how our plate looks full of strawberries. Pretty good, honestly. Delicious. So now what we're gonna do, got this. Oop, that tastes good. And now we're gonna whip our hair back. Get to the big business now. Okay, so now we got our pitcher. And we gotta get our ice. We're gonna go that. So the ice has been in the freezer since this morning. Um, 
Oh wow, they came out perfectly. Okay, so you just want to like crack them so then they all can come out. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, okay. So next thing that we're going to do is we're going to open up this. We're going to shake it and work on it. It's still very cold too. That's good. So we're going to open up that like that. Set the cap down and we're going to pour it in the pitcher. I think that's enough ice. And now we're going to add our puree. We're not going to add a lot, but we're going to add some honey to it. Because who doesn't like honey, honestly? And plus, they said that honey is good with strawberries in this, so I'm going to trust that. So we're going to put a lot of honey, squeeze that honey in. We got that in, so now we want to stir that up. Perfect. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to add in our puree. See a lot of chunks of the strawberries are coming in with it. Oh my god, guys, that smells so good. I wish y'all can come here and smell it. Like, that smells delicious. Okay, then we got the little thing that comes with the pitcher. Mix that up. Now what we want to do is we want to add a little bit of tea. Like, two cupfuls of tea. I recommend the Pure Leaf le uh, Tea Lemon made. Yeah, Tea Lemon made. That's what it is. Um, this is what it is. And now we're going to keep mixing that. Mix that all together. And now we are done, guys! This is what it finally looks like. This is literally what the thing looks like. I'll pop it up on the screen. Literally like almost the exact shape and everything. But now we're going to get our glass. This little glass right there. We're going to pour it in. We're going to try it. So, cheers guys. Let's try it for the first time. Okay. This actually looks good though. Like, thumbnail pick real quick. Hey, cute. Okay. Try it. That tastes so good! I love that, guys! Literally, it's like the strawberries, but then it's really like, it's nice and sweet with like the honey, and you can also like taste a little bit of the tea, but it's also really sweet with the lemonade and the strawberries, and you can taste like the fresh strawberries with it. I love this. This is so good. Like, I normally sometimes don't like different drinks, but this is really good. So now my next thing is to go to Starbucks. Taste it. Mine's probably better. This is really good. This is so good, guys. I like a pulp coming out, and I'm not getting my mouth, but I like it. I like it guys, this is amazing. I totally recommend it if y'all like want some good like food. If y'all want a good drink, take it. Like, this is really good guys, honestly. Number one for me, love it so much. Um, Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. This is literally one of the best drinks I have ever tasted. It's delicious, so. If y'all enjoyed this video, make sure you smash the like button, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell so you're notified every time I post a video. 
I love you all so much. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Cheers to that. And yeah, guys. So I hope you guys can make this drink too. Yeah. Love you so much. So I love you all so much. Stay safe. Stay positive. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.